Meghan Markle and Prince Harry attended one public event for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations before flying home with their two children Archie and Lilibet. Speaking on Dan Wooten's GB News show, Meghan Kelly branded the royal couple frauds, as she blasted them for previously urging the public to do more to protect the environment. Dan began, There's a lot of reason to boo Harry and Meghan, right? You know they're walking down those steps hearing those boos going, what a bunch of racists, Meghan replied. They will never come to terms with why the public has turned against them in your country and in mine. People can't stand them now because they realize they're a couple of frauds. Their environmentalism is a fraud. Their perpetual victimhood is a fraud. Their supposed need for privacy is a fraud and like any frauds if you spend enough time watching them they expose themselves over time. The environmental thing is fun though, she continued. I just went back for kicks to look at what they've said in the past and as you point out the actual travelist, their eco-friendly tourism initiative in 2019 could be the worst. But she's been touting this since 2016 on her blog that nobody read. It's important that we never forget the well-being of our good old Mama Earth, Megan read out. What did Mama Earth think about your carbon footprint on your 13-passenger jet that had its own separate stateroom on the way home? Now Dan back in the Fox News days when we would go and do the presidential debates sometimes they would get private jets for you so you could get there and back to the studio and I would travel with my assistant or my hair and makeup team or whatever. We would have a little jet that had six seats. We would much rather be in a commercial airplane this is scary. What do they need a 13 passenger jet for? Megan questioned. Because they think they're important. The American broadcaster continued to point out what she saw as eco-hypocrisy. This is the same couple that made you and your viewers pay $50,000 for an environmental boiler when they moved into Frogmore Cottage which the British taxpayers paid for and they made you the British people pay for their vegan paints for their cottage because they think you should pay for them to live in an environmental way while they then skulk off in their private jet creating a bigger carbon footprint than the average British citizen can hope to create in one's life, she said. Harry has said in the past, Oh we offset it all. This is what they all say all these environmental frauds, Megan vented. What that basically means is I paid some company enough money to plant enough trees to cover my carbon footprint. Most environmental groups will tell you that the whole thing is a bunch of nonsense. Half of these forests don't exist and by the way that happened to the Vatican so it could absolutely happen to these two.